12 years ago, I was in a serious car accident. It was a head-on collision. I broke everything but my left femur and my left arm and a brain injury, so I was in a coma for two months in the hospital for a total of seven. I found out that hippotherapy, which is physio on a horse, the summer I was out of the hospital, and I rode as a kid and loved it, and I thought, well, let's get on a horse and have physio. Over the years, I went from two sidewalkers and, and a leader to walking on my own and trotting on my own. And then my instructor would introduce some dressage moves. And then we went to the uh, Equine Canada C2C videos. I started leasing a horse two years ago and competing live. So I've competed two summers live. I can compete in the regular equestrian, but I, I prefer to compete at the para level. But there's not many athletes. We need to promote the sport to get more athletes. I want people to realize that if they have some injuries, they can compete in the sport. Not a lot of people would ever think about doing some physio on a horse. I'm riding Azure right now, so I've been riding Azure since uh, late summer, early fall. It's a challenge, it's not just you, it's you and the animal, and it's all these subtle movements in your legs and your hands and mostly your seat to make the horse do what you want it to do. I'm classified as a grade three, which means I'm judged on patterns in walk, trot, canter, and you can kind of compare it to figure skating. And you're judged from a zero to a 10, and zero meaning the element was not executed at all, and 10 is perfect. This will be my third um, pair of sport games. I competed in Sarnia and Kingston, and uh, I enjoy competing at the pair of sport games. You just get to see a lot of athletes, a lot of pair of athletes. I have a goal of eventually making the Pan Am Games in Toronto next year and maybe the Olympics in the Brazil in the year after. Mm -hmm.